We are gonna build one of the you know fundamental elements in a dungeon the table and a little chair this will be not a fancy tutorial you know something very accurate we are not crafting something for uh, dioramas or stuff like that we are just in search of something that boom in 20 minutes it's ready on the table before start please consider to support this channel through patreon follow the link below or through a little donation by PayPal. Stay a while and listen. Here I'm taking a piece of foam, five millimeter thick, and I'm cutting it two inches by one inch because this will be the measure of our table. Yeah, always a fresh blade for your uh, exacto knife. Here I'm tracing the lines that uh, represent the three main uh, wooden planks that we form the table. Check also my tutorial number four for the wood grain. I'm tracing the main grain with my pen and then I will uh, improve the texture with a metal brush, not too heavy. Remember the sidelines. For the legs of the table, I'm cutting a couple of pieces of foam that are one inch large and half inch high. I'm giving them a random shape with my knife using the first one as template for the second as you can see here And uh, with some PVA glue and some nails, I attach the legs to the table. Before put the nail, I measure the right distance between the legs and the end of the table. And then when I was sure that they were uh, totally at the same distance, I put my nails. They give uh, a lot of strength and also a little bit of uh, extra weight to my piece. Nice. Now for the chair, I use uh, some uh, very very thin uh, slices of foam, actually one of them, and I suggest you to trace the line before cut, so you will have a lot of wood and uh, it will be very very easy to treat later. I then measure a wood plank large uh, 3 quarter of inch and actually one eighth thick. Or if you prefer, around uh, 17 millimeters and uh, thick uh, three millimeters. I then measure a couple of pieces, 
one inch and a half inch and I cut that. I then cut off the two corners for uh, a better shape of my chair and uh, I glue the little one on the big one with a straight angle. You can use uh, PVA glue, also hot glue, whatever. I prefer use some plastic glue because it's uh, very rapid to attach and it's clean. Then I have uh, this piece that is actually 5 mm by 5 mm and I measure the four legs for the chair. Each leg is uh, one centimeter around uh, half inch. Also here, you need to trace the line before cut. It's easier to work than with the pieces already textured, okay? For some extra weight, also for uh, have some uh, extra strength, I use a couple of washers that are actually half inch on the bottom of my chair. And then I attached the four legs. For this particular chair, I attach with a straight angle the back once and then I put the front one in a 45 angle. You don't need to be scared if your legs are not uh, even. You can go to the proxen and with a rapid passage you can put everything on an even level. Don't forget the sidelines. Before paint, I'm uh, covering all the pieces with a mix of uh, acrylic black paint, water and Mod Podge. This will give a lot of strength and protection to my piece. Painting these pieces is uh, very simple. I just uh, use a semi-wet brush with uh, wood brown. When everything was dried, I just pass with a dry brush with a warm gray that gives a nice contrast with the brown. For detailing your pieces, you can uh, use uh, some metal reinforcement here I'm just uh, digging the holes for the nails that I forgot to put before. So I was uh, forced to use uh, some wash, brown wash, for uh, fill totally the holes and not see the foam. So after this uh, brown wash, I just redo the dry brush passage with my warm gray and that's it. Tactical pieces. I think the table and uh, chairs are very tactical pieces on your dungeon. You can use the table as high position for your fight or uh, your chair even as a weapon. Nice. Okay guys, this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And if you very like this video, remember to subscribe to the channel. Till next time. Happy crafting!